we have 21, that's right, 21 new games for this week, including Bethesda favorites. Stay tuned. Rise and shine, it's time to quake up. The GeForce Now Ultimate's Kovacs Challenge kicks off at the QuakeCon Gaming Festival today, giving gamers everywhere the chance to play their ultimate potential with ultra-high 240 frames per second streaming. On top of bragging rights, top scorers can win some sweet prizes, including a 240Hz gaming monitor. Free and priority members can stream the GeForce Now Ultimate's Kovacs Challenge demo, then get a free one-day upgrade to 240 FPS gaming with GeForce Now Ultimate to instantly experience a major performance improvement. Yes, you heard this right. Play the demo once and get a one-day upgrade to the Ultimate tier for absolutely free. Members can keep an eye out for an email that will arrive once their free one-day upgrade is available. Replay the demo unlimited times on Ultimate during the one-day upgrade and aim to get the top score against other GeForce Now members on the challenge leaderboard. QuakeCon attendees and those playing from home can compete for prizes through Thursday, September 21st. Keep an eye out on Twitter and Facebook for more details and the complete prize list. The link to the challenge is in the description with terms and conditions. I was able to play on the free tier and the game runs pretty terribly. The frame rate was horrible, but I got a score of 1127. Playing on the ultimate tier, however, was a massive improvement. Got a score of 1807. Can you beat it? Hopefully so. This way your score will put you on the top of the leaderboard to win some nice prizes. Now speaking of QuakeCon, we were supposed to be there. Yep, face reveal and showcasing GeForce Now with some interviews was our original plan. It fell through. We are planning something else for our big face reveal though, so stay tuned. Now for this week's Bethesda games to be released on the platform. Raise down enemies from hell as the Doom Slayer in Doom Eternal. Stream the solo campaign or grab a few buddies for online multiplayer with Battle Mode. Quake fans can stream the classic Quake game that started it all and step into the shoes of the formidable Ranger to take down an army of twisted creatures. Enjoy both a solo campaign and online co-op mode for up to four players. Then take on high-tech bad guys from World War II in a twisted version of history with Wolfenstein The New Order, Wolfenstein II The New Colossus, and Wolfenstein Youngblood. Told you guys these games were coming, and yes, I did buy them all on Steam since they were on sale. So get ready for a slaughter fest, quite literally. We have plenty of content coming for these games, so stay tuned. Now for the list of all 21 games to be added this week. First we have I Am Future, a new release on Steam. Atlas Fallen, a new release on Steam. Orwell, keeping an eye on you. A free game on the Epic Game Store from now through August 16th. Sengoku Dynasty, a new release on Steam. Tales and Tactics, a new release on Steam. Aliens Dark Descent, available on the Epic Game Store. Doom Eternal, available on Steam. Lego Brawls, available on the Epic Game Store. Quake, available on Steam and the Epic Game Store. Session Skate Sim, available on the Epic Game Store. Small Land. Survive the Wilds, available on the Epic Game Store. Super Hot, available on the Epic Game Store. Terra Invicta, available on the Epic Game Store. The Ultimate Kovacs Challenge. Wall World, available on Steam. Wild West Dynasty, available on the Epic Game Store. Wolfenstein The New Order, available on Steam and the Epic Game Store. Wolfenstein Youngblood, available on Steam. Wolfenstein 2, The New Colossus, available on Steam. Wreckfest, available on the Epic Game Store. And finally, Xenonauts 2, available on the Epic Game Store. If you like this week's news overview of GeForce Now, feel free to give us a like. Also, make sure to subscribe at the only place where you can do battle in gaming heaven, Cloud Gaming Battle.